when you look inside and you don't find yourself, that itself is the finding. You have found what you are when you look in and don't find. You have found your own self-luminous quality. Infinite consciousness, spirit. You may not recognize what you found. Great Zen master Dogen called that being enlightened before you're enlightened. You look inside and realize there's nobody there but emptiness in all directions. You have found the truth, but you may not realize you found the truth. That recognition may not flash like lightning where you realize, ah, that's what I am. If I am anything, I am this nothing. You can find it without realizing it. That's what Dogen meant when he said to be enlightened before you're enlightened. Because you have to be enlightened. Because enlightened means just being the truth. So you can't not be who you are. But the question is, is, is the recognition there? Do we, is the knowingness of our true nature alive? And a quality of this self-luminous nature is that this self-luminous nature, by whatever name you give it, this self-luminous nature is a lover of what is. That's a good indication that you have started to stumble upon the beautiful truth is that inside you become a lover of what is. A lover of isness. No longer are you a lover of what could be. What could be stops interesting you as soon as you find your true nature. What could be is just a painful dream. It's what we do if we're completely asleep at the wheel and already dead. Most people are already dead. <laughs> or half alive. But what a gift we find that this self-luminous, this awake presence is a lover of what is. It, lo it loves what is. And you, some of you understand this because you've experienced it and you know this. And some of you have yet to understand it and experience it, but you will. And it's surprising when you realize the truth loves what is. It sounds simple until you find that the truth really is a lover of what is. What is could be rotten. What is could be sickness, old age, death, decay, being cold, being hungry being disagreed with. But still, the true lover is a lover of what is. 